If you look at JavaScript code, you may see three different ways of defining variables. First one is known as var, second one is let, and third one is const. You may be wondering what is the difference between all three of them. I'm going to give you a few examples to kind of motivate what is the difference. Although it's not cru crucial for understanding the homework assignments, it is an important thing to know if you're learning JavaScript. So the var, the way you have to understand it is that it's a function global variable. That's what you're defining. And it's a mutable variable, which means you can reassign it if you want. So in this case, if I, in the first line, I, as, I declare this mutable variable x, I can then reassign it with x equals 10, which is safe. If I, at any point inside the function, I write another var, another var that does not create a new variable because x is unsculpted, is global to the whole code. So effectively, it's a dynamically scoped variable uh, local to the function, if you will. So the second version is let, and let creates a local variable and cannot be redeclared in the same scope, but can be redeclared in different scopes. So it's it's a very nice way of declaring a variable. So we can we declare a variable by saying let, but we can assign it. So here it is, we are assigning. So we can define let x, uh, and now we can assign it with, with x equals 10. So we can find an error if you define another let, let's say here, you would get an error because you already declared x in that scope. So if you declare let, it is only visible, this x is only visible inside of this. So the scoping is the syntactic scoping, okay? And it is mutable. The other version is const, and const is a local variable, kind of like let, but unlike let, you cannot reassign something. So if you do const number within the same scope, you cannot redefine it, right? So for instance, here, which is in the same scope as outside, I would not be able to assign something else to number because I would get an error. But if I'm inside another scope, let's say with a block of code, then I can create a new variable const with the same name. Right? That's fine because it's in within another scope. So it, it's another variable. So that's more or less how it works. So for instance, this assignment would be incorrect because it is a const. Okay, so this explain the difference between var, let, and const.